Hey Val, wanna grow grass on the balcony and make this a fun hangout space for you? Yeah, let's build it. Val loves the outdoors, but living in a condo can sometimes make it difficult for her to have outside time. So we're going to turn our balcony into a doggy sanctuary. The idea is to add grass to the balcony and some walls to keep her safe. As far as the grass, we have a few options. We can use artificial grass. We can use sod. Or we could use real grass. Artificial grass, that's the easy way out. Sod, where's the fun in that? We're going to do something we haven't seen done yet. Grow real grass. The plan is to first build a frame, then add a waterproof barrier, add the dirt and seeds, and then add a protective layer to keep everything in place. Enough talk, let's get building. We'll have a list of all the parts we use during the build down description below. We're going to start off by using these to build our frame. I believe they're called caution sharp edges. First, we cut all the pieces to length. Then we're able to split the pieces in two by first scoring with a knife, then bending it until it snaps into two. The cool part about this method is it works great for just about everything like carrots. Markers. And coffee pots. And then we're able to assemble the frame together with some zip ties. Here's how the frame turned out. We got it to cover the whole balcony. It's trimmed low enough here so we can still open this door. It goes all the way around under our bench. And we just need to trim all the zip ties. For the waterproof barrier, we're going to reuse this old plastic that our mattress was shipped in and secure it with some tape. Halfway through, we discovered a hole in the plastic, so we patched it up with some extra plastic and tape. And with the plastic in place, it's time to add the dirt. Very quickly we realized we didn't buy enough bags of dirt, so we went over to our dirt bag neighbor to see if he had any. And Lucky for us, he did. That gave us just enough dirt to finish the job. We chose these grass seeds to plant because they have the shortest germination time, with four to seven days, and sound like the most robust seeds at the store. We didn't know how many seeds to use, so we planted about this many. And then to protect the seeds, we found this burlap. We 
I just cut it to size and placed it on top. Now it's time to just sit back and watch our grass grow. That didn't quite go as planned. Who likes to dig, Val? Who likes to dig? Who, who likes, yeah, to you dig? like to dig? You like to dig. And so it's time to take the easy way out. While we wait for the artificial grass to arrive, we'll quickly put the safety walls together using these 1x2s, some dry erase panels, and some deck screws. And we got our artificial grass. We were hoping to be able to get the grass underneath the bench legs, but we were unable to lift it high enough. You want this 2x4 as a lever, so we're going to have to change our plans a bit and Cut the grass to fit around the legs. Everything is all trimmed up and in place and actually looks pretty good. Now just take the advice of one of the reviews on Amazon and fluff up the grass with a quick vacuum. Overall didn't quite go as planned, but I think it turned out pretty good in the end. It would still be really cool to be able to grow real grass on the balcony one day. We might have to take another stab at this project later on with a more scientific approach. Let us know if that's something you'd like to see and leave your build ideas down in the comments. How do you think it turned out, Bell? You like it?